Looking up at the stars as a young suburban gal always felt like I was being teased. Sure, I could see more stars than the average city folk, but I was still missing the whole picture. There are 88 constellations in the night sky recognized by the International Astronomical Union, and I can only see five in my backyard on a good night. Not that I could recognize those I could see. I had a hard time connecting the dots, so to speak. I had no idea how people could see images of gods or creatures out of these spots in the night sky. But there was always one constellation among the suburban lit sky I could easily point out. Or at least part of the constellation. Orion's Belt. A simple constellation made up of three stars in a line. As a kid, I didn't know the lore behind Orion or his belt. Even when I went through my Greco-Roman phase in middle school, I didn't pay much attention to Orion. I only knew Orion because of a reference to it in the first Men in Black movie, but that didn't matter because every time I spotted Orion's belt in the night sky, I felt like a genius. Fast forward a few years later, and here I am on the Stars at Night team as the creative assistant. It's my job to research the constellations and the stories cultures around the world would tell of them. I have no excuse not to know Orion's story now. Orion is made up of eight prominent stars. Rigel, Betelgeuse, Bellatrix, Nysa, Seyf, Mintaka, Alnan, Alnantak. The last three are what make up Orion's belt. Orion gets its name, like many constellations, from the Greeks. In Greek mythology, Orion was a gigantic, super strong hunter, born to O'Reilly, a gorgon, and Poseidon, the god of the sea. He is said to have two hunting dogs, Procyon and Sirius who are the stars in the constellation Canis Minor and Canis Major, respectively. In our previous video, the Pleiades, we covered that Orion was hunting the seven sisters that made up the constellation of the Pleiades. The constellation of Orion is said to still pursue them across the night sky. In Muslim astronomy, Orion is known as Al-Jabbar, the giant. Orion's sixth brightest star, Saif, is named from the Arabic Saif al-Jabbar, meaning Sword of the Giant. But not all cultures see Orion as a hunter. The Chinook, a northwestern Native American tribe, located in present-day Oregon, saw Orion's belt as a big canoe in the race to see who can be the first to catch a salmon in the Big River or the Milky Way. In the Northern Hemisphere, Orion is most visible in the winter, sometime between January and April. It's one thing to read and research a topic. It's a whole other thing to see it in person. But after all the research, I have a new fondness for the constellation of Orion, because now, when looking up at the night sky on a cold winter's night, I too become a hunter, searching for Orion. But it's never hard finding him, all I have to do is look for the three stars that make up his belt.